Ole, 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 and welcome to All Your Living Needs. I'm your host, Jono, and this is the predictions for Columbus Crew versus Chivas USA. So this game is taking place Sunday, September 7th at 3 p.m. Previous meetings have seen Columbus win two, lose one, and tie two. Season goal leaders for the Columbus crew of Federico Higuan with nine points, nine goals, Ethan Finley with six goals, and Justin Merrim with five goals. Chivas USA has Eric Torres with 14 goals, Marvin Chavez with two goals, Burling, Pelotari, Delgado, McNamara, and Barrera all with one goals each. Columbus Crew has played 26 games. Chivas has played 25 games. Columbus Crew has won 8, lost 9, and drawn 9. The Chivas USA has won 6, lost 13, and drawn 6. The Crew lost to Montreal 2-0 to, two to zero Saturday, August 30th. The Crew played an aggressive first half, which nearly scored them a goal in the fifth minute, uh, with a... Uh, and along with several long ball attempts, the crew were blocked out of scoring. Though Huguan and Aaron Schoenfeld did keep the heat of Montreal on Montreal's goalkeeper, Evan Bush. Disciplinary report, Tachani and Trapp are one caution away from a suspension. Disabled list has midfielder Kinsley Fifi Baden with a left groin hip strain. Uh, midfielder Matt Wyatt with a left ACL reconstruction. Defense Josh Williams with a left groin strain. Defense Augustine Viana with a right calf strain. They are currently fifth in the Eastern Conference. Chivas continued their losing streak, adding another a shutout game by the LA Galaxy 0-3 to to their terrible record. Chivas only had 39% possession of the ball throughout the game. They made eight attempts at goal with two on target and four off target and two blocked. The star player for Chivas is Dan Kennedy, the goalkeeper who managed to fend off attacking LA Galaxy for the first 40 minutes of play, but finally succumbed to the brute force attacks. Disciplinary report, Tony Lockheed is out with a yellow card accumulation, and Burling, Pelletieri, and Torres, and Minda are all one caution away from a suspension. Disabled list has midfielder Thomas McNamara with a right ACL reconstruction, midfielder Martin Rivera with a right ACL reconstruction, and a defense, Carlos Bocanegra, with a concussion. They are currently ninth in the Western Conference. So I really wish that we had promotion and relegation in the state, and hopefully that's the next step the MLS will be taking. But honestly... Chivas USA, and for that matter, Montreal Impact, should feel the weight of their poor playing and at the end of the season be moved down to the minor leagues. And I've said before I like Montreal, and with their win against Columbus Crew, there are some redeemable aspects of the team. Of course, it's a little late in the season now, but for Chivas, there is no winning this game. Unless the crew are so shocked by their loss against Montreal, which they aren't, uh, then perhaps this is a chance for Chivas to win. But otherwise, this is a pure win for the crew. I'm expecting a 2-0 to zero Columbus crew, if not even more goals on score, uh, possibly a 4-0. to zero. But I don't see Chivas uh, scoring anything against the crew. So listen, hey, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, share, Facebook. Make sure that you sign up for the giveaway of our cleats. We have another great contest already in the works for October. Uh, ole, ole, ole. Have a safe and happy week. Cheers. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.